She absolutely stole the show yes, when she, she was did. here last month. She has put her own stamp on the city as a dancer, community leader, and model, and she's still doing it at age 90. Yeah, with her never-ending stamina, she is teaching younger generations how to move with their bodies and their minds. I'm not just about dancing. I'm about their character, their attitude, them being special. You don't have to be the brightest, and you don't have to be the what they call the prettiest. You find something. I find something in every child I have. And then I make them even more special. She doesn't hold back. And um, I, I have to um, listen a little bit more to her details because she wants it, she knows what she wants. And, and when you do it slightly your way, um, she, she corrects you immediately. And I'm glad she does that because now my homework is better. It's unbelievable how blessed I am to be working with her. I have brought everything into my classes from what, when I started in New York. I also danced in a nightclub. You learn something in a nightclub. You learn with all the drunks. You learn to smile and always look like you're enjoying what you're doing. So that's performance. Oh, I love being different. I didn't like being the same. I got that attitude when I was 16 years old in high school. I saw all my girlfriends, and all my girlfriends were smart and bright, and there they were going on to Vassar, Harvard, Yale, whatever, Michigan. But I went to New York to study ballet. My husband made it very easy. He was very versatile, and he allowed me, he helped me continue on with what I like to do. The mothers I, and fathers I have today, they are special mothers. They are mothers that need to be recognized and need to be given credit because they are giving us quality children and they come to me for quality care. She just makes you want to be better and want to do some of the things that she's doing. She's amazing with the kids and she's just overall amazing and a great role model for us moms. She's like the perfect epitome of what it's like to be 90. She brings the sass, the class, and she's just overall fabulous. It is your attitude and this is what I want to pass on to the children I'm around now. I have a lot of children now, and if you meet them, you can tell that they're my children. Kendra said, I want you to be my assistant. She never saw me dance, but she saw my attitude. She saw my presence. I'm getting chills just sitting here talking about the influence that she's had on the girls and even myself. Even myself, she's taught me to be a calmer teacher. She's taught me to uplift. She's taught me to give criticism, but also build the girls back up. She's honestly like such a hero. I love her so much. I've been working with her for about three years now. She's taught me so much and I never ever take her class for granted because I know in the future it's really going to impact my life as a dancer. She helps me with my confidence and helps all the girls with, her, with their confidence. I've been very blessed. I tell people I'm one of the richest women that I know because it's not, it's many things. It's not the stuff or the money or, it's the people that I've met along the way. I hope this 90 year old body will be able to continue doing what she's been doing. <laughs>